Good morning. Today we are going to do some demonstration on the energy harvesting features of the SD25DV NFC dynamic tag. We use the SD25DV discovery with antenna C1, which is a credit card size antenna. We also use antenna C5, slightly small antenna. We use a typical Galaxy S8 phone and also the SD25R3911B as a source of RF energy. Okay, before we start to look into the um, how much energy is being harvested using the hardware, I want to remind you about the power transfer over RF. If the antenna is around this small, it is ideal that this is the tag antenna. It would be ideal that the read antenna is about the same size. This is ideal. So the read antenna can be either a you know a, a NFC phone or a commercial reader and the tag antenna is of the SD25 DV. Now if if you have a fairly um, large reader antenna right and then you have a fairly small tag antenna the energy transfer wouldn't be as great because the field strength is right around the conductor and it radiated outward and so on so there will be feel inside the interior of the antenna but it won't be as strong as it is if it's near the conductor of the reader antenna so keep that in mind as we progress through our um, experimentation so how, how do we get to the energy harvesting section of the SE25DV when you first start it plug in USB port, either port will work by the way you hit the black button to reset the board and then you will hit SD25DV and you go to energy harvesting now you take your phone closer angles you can read notice the amber light the LED turns on so use that as a guide as it the phone is further away from the antenna it will start flashing when it's not as well coupled but when it's really coupled it will stay lit pretty brightly and you can move your, your phone around so that you can actually see difference in energy harvesting and where the energy is strong and weak and how much power you can harness from this uh, configuration now we use a small antenna and you can compare the two and so that you can see how much energy is harvesting using the small antenna versus the large antenna also i like to use the sc25r3911b development board discovery board set for polling mode I can start seeing the difference 
as you can see even at a very far range the longer range there it is, is lit quite brightly you will see the maximum power can go pretty high This is the phone and they're using a small antenna. Okay, so in conclusion, use the SC25 DV as a excellent mean to measure our fuel power and use it to determine different antenna size and different reader can produce different result thank you